Howard was a star wide receiver here at Gateway High School. He was just starting his college career at the University of Virginia when he says he was forced into a fight and hazed so bad that he had to leave the school. Number four is Aiden Howard in action at Gateway High, a gifted athlete with a promising future. Randy Harper has known Howard's family for years. Got a scholarship. I mean, schools were courting him from all over the country and they finally settled on on UVA. But when Pitt played at UVA last weekend, Howard was not on the Cavaliers' sideline. Instead, he'd filed a federal lawsuit against the university, claiming other Virginia players bullied and hazed him because, quote, they perceived him to be soft and not manly like other student athletes in the football program. In August, Howard even says the players, quote, marked off a ring in the football program's locker room using athletic tape, then forced Aiden and another player to enter the ring to flashing lights, loud music, and announcements to simulate a prize fight. The suit claims 105 people watched that fight, including a graduate assistant who yelled no phones to the other players so they couldn't record it. The lawsuit claims the fight left Howard with a concussion and a broken orbital bone. He had surgery for it late last month. His lawyer says he might not be able to play football again. Howard left UVA. He's now at Robert Morris University. Harper hopes they can resolve this ugly incident quickly. He's one of the most wonderful kids I've ever met. I mean, he's soft-spoken. Um, he's hardworking. Um, he worked for me over the summer uh, landscaping, and um, I couldn't ask for a, a better guy to work for me. Howard's lawyer would not speak to us on camera today, and the lawsuit doesn't say how much they're seeking from the University of Virginia, but it does say they want at least $75,000. Reporting in Monroeville, Bob Hayes in Pittsburgh's Action News 4.